the U.S. has begun three days of tributes to the late Supreme Court Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg. She died on Friday at the age of 87. She'd served 27 years on America's highest court. And today, more than 100 of Ginsburg's former law clerks stood at attention on the steps of the Supreme Court, awaiting her arrival one last time. Dignitaries and mourners from across the U.S. also gathered to pay their respects. As Jackson Prosco reports, Ginsburg had a significant impact on law, gender equality, and later in life, even pop culture. She made one final journey up those white marble steps. Justice Ruth Bader Ginsburg was carried silently past an army of her former law clerks and into the Supreme Court. This was Justice Ginsburg's life's work, to insist that the Constitution deliver on its promise. At a private service, there was high praise from the Chief Justice. Among the words that best describe Ruth, tough, brave, a fighter, a winner. Later, as Ginsburg lay in repose outside, Americans paused in tribute, including Bill and Hillary Clinton. It was the former president who nominated her to the high court. To protect women and men for the right to live, the right to vote. She's someone I've idolized for a long time. Terrence Kane had the chance to meet Ginsburg when he was just 14. Today, he says, he understands her impact. The idea that equality under law is necessary. It's, it's, it is law. It, it, is, it is what we have to believe in. It's what we need to, to succeed. Few believe there will be another justice like RBG, especially with Republicans expected to confirm a new justice ideologically opposite to Ginsburg in the coming weeks. I don't think we'll see the likes of her again in our lifetime, and so I wanted to show her our respect. At a critical juncture in American history, the passing of this icon of equality may bring about a legacy of its own, inspiring Americans to fight for the values bestowed upon them by this very court. Jackson Prosco, Global News, Washington.